Like many of you, I get a lot of mail on a weekly basis. I mean, just look at this pile here. And while some of it is junk mail that can just be tossed out or recycled, you do get the occasional family letter, a postcard, and those bills which honestly do get paid on a regular basis. But if you are anything like me and have a home office, you might wanna hold on to those bills for the end of the year for tax purposes. Now, a lot of people would simply stack things up and make a neat little pile, maybe shove it off into a corner or file them away into a filing cabinet if you have an organizational system already set up. But if you're looking for a digital solution to organize a mess like this, I think you've come to the right place. Today I'm gonna to be showing you a neat little trick and all you're gonna need is your Android smartphone or a tablet as well, a scanner like this one, and then a Wi-Fi connection to make sure everything's connected. And then you're gonna to need to download the Mopria Scan app. Now, a while back, we did introduce you to the Mopria print service from the Mopria Alliance, the group that's responsible for the technology behind Android's default print service. It essentially allows any Android smartphone that's running on Android 8 or higher to wirelessly connect and then print to more than 120 million Mopria certified products, just like this printer right here. The same team has also developed technology that allows you to scan documents and wirelessly transfer those scanned files to your Android powered smartphone or even a tablet without the need to use a laptop like this one or even your desktop PC. And that's exactly what we're gonna be showing you today. As we've done in the past, we're partnering with the Mopri Alliance to show you how to use the Mopria Scan app to help you stay a little bit more organized in your home or your office. So let's get started. To start things off, you'll need to install the Mopria Scan app from the Google Play Store onto your smartphone or your tablet. And just as a reminder, this only works on Android. For Mopria Scan to work, you will need a compatible Wi-Fi connected scanner or print scanner combo. And you will need to make sure that your Android device and your scanner are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. Next, find the document or the photo that you wanna scan and place it on the scanner. Open the Mopria Scan app and then select the scanner from the list. If you are in a larger corporate office, there's a good chance that you'll have four to five or even a dozen different scanner options here. If that's the case, you can tap the star next to the scanner that you use the most so that it's always at the top of your list. Next, just tap the scanner that you place your document or photo in and you'll be able to see the scan properties that you'll have at your disposal. Here, you'll be able to select the type of document that you're gonna be scanning, the file format, and I recommend PDF for documents and a JPEG if you're scanning a photo, the color preferences, resolution, and even the compression level for the scan. If you're not sure which options are best, I do recommend always sticking with at least 300 by 300 as your minimum resolution for scanning a document and then maxing things out completely at at least 1200 by 1200 for photos to make sure you have the highest resolution possible. And then when scanning a document, you can just go ahead and select the document size from that drop-down list. But if you're scanning a photo, I recommend selecting Define on Preview and then tapping the Preview button. This will give you a quick low resolution scan and allow you to select the area that you'd like scanned by dragging the circles on the four corners to crop in. Once you have your area set, tap the scan button for a full resolution scan. This will take anywhere from two seconds to over a minute for the file then to show up on your smartphone or tablet, depending on the scanner speed and the resolution of the scan that you picked. The default file name will be today's date and time, but you can easily change that by tapping the pencil icon right next to that with your own file name that you want for the file or the folder that you scanned. To save the file to your Android device though, make sure you press that download button in the top bar. This will save the file to the Mopria Scan app on the internal storage of your Android smartphone or the tablet. If you do need to share that file immediately, you can always just tap that share icon in the top right hand corner and then select which app you wanna share it with. And that share function also works with Android's nearby share functionality, allowing you to share the file wirelessly to any nearby Android devices, which is extremely convenient. To clean up this pile of documents that I have here and make sure I have a digital archive in the cloud as well, I'm gonna be selecting the Google Drive option after tapping the share button. Here, it's gonna ask me to confirm the file name, select the account that I want it uploaded to or upload them to multiple accounts, and then pick the folder that I'm gonna be putting it into. It's as simple as that. 
Now I have a copy of the document on my smartphone and also in the cloud as well, just in case anything happens to the smartphone. I also do wanna point out that if you do have a printer scanner just like this one, the Epson ET4800 that sports a document feeder on the top, you can also use that for scanning multiple documents at once, just like you would for making photocopies. Just select the feeder option from the scan source dropdown, and then make sure that you select if the documents are one or two sided. If you are saving the file as a PDF, you'll be given the option to save all of the pages into a single PDF file or have them all saved individually as well. Mopri Scan is definitely a must have app for your Android device. And especially if you wanna keep the clutter down in your office and get rid of stacks and stacks of piles of papers just like this one. If you wanna check out Mopri Scan for yourself, be sure to check the links in the video description or simply head on over to mopria.org. I'd like to thank Mopria for sponsoring this video and their support for our channel and thank you guys for watching. If you wanna see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe to the channel and hit that bell icon as well. It really helps out a lot. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.